Hi everyone, I know it's been a while since I made a video. Um, I've been just really busy with projects and stuff at work and just other stuff. Just, you know, living my life and not necessarily focusing on the Watchtower Bible Track Society every day, which is good. Um, but I did, wanna, I did want to make another video because I saw, which I was really surprised to see how many views my channel has got because I kind of feel like I'm just out in a corner somewhere and not that many people are watching not you know um and i'm hoping that some jehovah's witnesses are watching and maybe i can help them to start thinking and stop obeying the watchtower bible track society well um you know the watchtower bible track society all they're really concerned about is is, is making sure that you obey and not think for yourself for a long time, I used to think that, um, you know, being at the Kingdom Hall and hearing children beat into submission, you know, by God, you will be quiet while we dispense our mind control from the platform. I don't care if you're teething, you're going to shut it up while we try to make sure everyone's mind is under our control. You know, and I would, I've gone to other religious meetings in other um, churches and synagogues and other places and it's amazing that I noticed that I didn't hear a whole bunch of children crying or getting beat because I was just so used to that in the background that I just I thought it was normal and when I realized that oh my goodness that is so not normal you should not beat your kid to make them sit through and listen to this crap they're a kid children can't sit that still for that long for two pretty much two straight hours that's crazy but that's what they do they want obedience from everybody from the oldest to the youngest it doesn't matter everybody has to obey because if you get out of line and you start thinking for yourself then they're gonna have to get rid of you they're going to have to just fellowship you, shun you, or do something. Because you're going to make other people think. And they want you to stop thinking and obey. That's what they want you to do. Stop thinking and obey. They're such a ruthless organization. The more and more I learn about it, the more and more my stomach is turned. I was watching uh, Pop Brooklyn's video the other day of his little girl. And what she was saying about him and hide and go seek and about demons and just it just made me sick because I it just made me sick and sad to know that they are getting to her her mind they're trying to control her mind it, it's just all they want is to control your mind and for you to give them money and of course they in the meantime they're going to write support letters for pedophiles who are you know going to jail for like 30 years they're going to support pedophiles and give a crap about children as long as they're getting their money in their contribution boxes that's all they're concerned about and that they have your complete obedience i don't know though we are less than two years away from 2014 and I really don't know how they're going to explain how 100 years have passed and all the people that weren't supposed to grow up, the new system was supposed to be here by now, all of that mess. I really don't know how they're going to explain that. But I'm pretty sure they, they have some really good spin people. I mean, really. I never, ever would have thought they would have had two sets of magazines, a public one and one a study copy. That shows you how much they want to control. They have a front face that they show to the community. And then they have this sneaky, evil face that they show to their people. You know, if anyone is watching this that, you know, is a Jehovah's Witness, you know, you need to think for yourself. Every time you think about doing something, every decision you make, it goes back to what the watchtower says. 
And I know you're going to say, oh, no, it's the Bible. Well, tell you what. Let me tell you to try something and tell me what happens. Go to your elders and tell them that you want to only read the Bible for a month. See what happens. They want you to obey their Watch, Turn, Awake and all their other books. They can't have you breaking the chain. They can't have you thinking for yourself. They want you to stop thinking and obey. That is not, you are not free when you can't have your own thoughts. You are not free when no matter anything that really means something to you, you have to hide it. It could be the smallest thing, a small amount of your humanity or individuality. They don't want that. They want to stomp that out and turn you into one of their drones. They don't care about children or spouses that are abused. Just the other day, and I'll put the link below where they wrote, you know, in support of a pedophile. They got 30 years in prison, but they're supportive of that person. But somebody like me, they got molested. Oh, they're not supportive. They could care less. They want me to shut it up, stop thinking, and obey what they have to say. Those days have passed. <laughs> I've yet I've been thinking on my own for so long now, and I haven't obeyed what they've said in years, and I, I'm not about to start doing it. But 2014, people, think about that. Think about how many generations. Think about how many children have been born. Think about how many times they sang that same stupid song. Oh, you won't even grow up. The new system will be around. It's just around the corner. They have to have that sense of urgency to make you act, to make you want to do something. It's like putting a gun to your head. Stop, obey, do what we say. Or the new system or Jehovah's going to kill you. That crap is scary. It's scary. If you haven't seen Pop Brooklyn's video of his daughter, go watch it. She's afraid in that video. She's scared. They have mind control. And it's terrible. Well, that's all I had to say for today. This is just a short video. Um, not sure when my next video will come, but when I think about something that I remember or an experience that I've had, I'll definitely make sure that I I make a video um, about what's going on, um, what's happening in my life a little bit. Um, maybe I'll talk more about that at a later date. But hopefully everyone had a great Thanksgiving if you live in the U.S., um, and everyone else, I hope you had a great day. Um, thanks, and I will talk to you guys again in the next video. Bye for now.